Losing weight is very challenging, especially when you're required to follow a specific diet with lots of food restrictions, including mind and muscle numbing workouts that leave your body sore until the next day. But how would you react if I tell you, you can lose weight without dieting, exercising, and counting calories? You would be outraged, of course. You'll be thinking, all my hard work is meaningless? My diet plans, workout routines? No, they're not meaningless. We just found new ways on how to lose pounds without complicated and strict rules to follow. Know more about these tips with Lose weight without counting calories. Avoid obesity. Hi there! Looking for something fun and healthy? Come and be in your best shape with us. Welcome to Mr. Pink and Mrs. Blue, where we go on our healthy lifestyle journey one step at a time. I am Mrs. Blue, here to deliver proven tips to help you lose weight without worrying about the calories. I know you're a bit skeptical, but it really is possible. We won't say things on our channel that aren't facts. We want to give you the best content you could ever ask for. Before we begin, if you are new to our channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell beside it to stay updated on how to lose weight and stay healthy along the way. If you're ready, let's get started. Number 1. When eating unhealthy food, serve it on small red plates. A study has been conducted to a number of volunteers where they served pretzels on red, white, and blue plates. After the experiment, results have shown that volunteers consumed fewer pretzels placed on red plates than on white and blue ones. So the question is, why? Apparently, our brain associates the color red to stop signals, as seen in road signs and traffic lights. When our eyes see a red signage, our brain receives the message to stop. Another reason is the emotion that red contains depending on human interpretation. For example, I see red as anger and negativity. Therefore, it will stop me from consuming food placed on plates of the same color. If you don't have a red plate in your house, maybe it's time to buy one. It's not bad to manipulate your brain sometimes for the benefit of your health, right? Number 2. Keep your electronics off the table. Eating while watching TV, scrolling through your phone, watching vlogs, playing games, or even checking your emails may lead to excessive eating because you're preoccupied with other things and lose track of what you eat. Try to focus on eating and later on, you'll realize how much food you really need before you hear your tummy say, I'm full. Pay attention to yourself and what you eat. Stop checking your social media accounts. You'll always have enough time for that. You won't die if you turn off your phone and laptop for a second. Do you know what will? Poor eating habits. So stop and just turn it back on after you eat. Not letting yourself eat peacefully is another way of being rude to oneself. So do yourself a favor and keep your gadgets off the dinner table. Listen to your mom. Number 3. Chew your food slowly and thoroughly. If you're the type of person who eats really fast, stop! This may be the reason why you don't lose weight even if you tried. Studies have shown that fast eaters have a higher risk of obesity because their brains can't process their food intake properly due to quick chewing. So if you're really committed to shifting your lifestyle, slow down and savor every bite. This will help your brain have enough time to process whether or not you need more food, leading to decreased food intake, increased fullness, and smaller portion size. Slow down and let your tummy absorb the amount you've eaten. But don't slow down by watching TV, okay? That option is off the table. Number 4. Consume more protein. As we've mentioned many times on this channel, protein makes you full, reducing your hunger and calorie intake. This is because of the affected hormones that influence hunger and fullness, including ghrelin and GLP-1. 
If you're currently consuming bread and grains for breakfast, you might want to switch to protein-rich meals, including eggs, lean chicken, lean pork, fish, lean beef, tofu, beans, low-fat yogurt, milk, cheese, seeds, and nuts. Add these to your brekkie meals to keep you full until lunch to avoid snacking. Number 5. Avoid storing unhealthy food. As long as you can see these temptations, you'll find it really hard to resist. So, to make this weight loss journey come to reality, start crossing out your favorite chips and sugary beverages off your grocery list. Spend your budget on health-friendly snacks that will contribute to your goal. If you want the results, you must put in the work. This tip is a way of having self-discipline and control to resist temptations. Sure, it's good to treat yourself every once in a while, but make sure to fill your stomach with healthier options. Treating yourself doesn't mean overeating, so consume sufficient amounts only. If you do buy unhealthy snacks, make sure to store them in places that you won't easily see and place the healthy ones in accessible areas such as countertops. Yes, it's hard to forget your favorite potato chips and soda, but it's for your own good. You do want to live longer, right? If so, let's do this. I know you can do it. Number 6. Stop emotional eating. People under stress tend to release emotional burden through eating excessive amounts of food, also known as stress eating. I know how it feels because I've been there. Way back when I was a student, whenever I felt pressured about deadlines, I would eat my favorite snacks, hoping that it would take the pressure away. But it didn't. I just looked bloated afterwards and felt bad about myself even more. I'm telling you as early as now, stop binge eating. Instead of losing weight, you'll end up gaining more. How ironic, right? Try to think of other things where you'll be able to release your stress, like meditation, walks in parks, conversations with friends, family chats, reading, and much more. There are a lot of fun things to do other than eating. I'm 100% sure that you can find one that suits you. Number 7. Drink sufficient amounts of water regularly. For our final tip, of course, water. Aside from keeping you hydrated, drinking water can also affect your food intake, especially when consumed before meals. It will make you feel fuller, leading to less food, hence reduced calorie intake. It's time to replace sugary drinks with the most popular drink in the world, water! Ah, my all-time favorite! In conclusion, proper self-discipline will help you achieve your dream bod, without exercising, dieting, and counting calories. Your dreams are not far from possible. You just need to have some self-control to avoid temptations. And you've practiced that. You're good to go. How about you? Do you have some habits you wish to share? Let us know in the comments below. Replace unhealthy snacks in your grocery list with superfoods. Check out 5 Best Superfoods to Boost Weight Loss 2020 Nutrition Facts Seeking for health inspiration? Feel free to visit and follow our Facebook page and Instagram account, Mr. Pink and Mrs. Blue, where we share motivational quotes to help people go through their fitness journey with a positive mindset. That is all for today. Again, I am Mrs. Blue. Don't forget, walk on your fitness journey one step at a time. Mr. Pink and Mrs. Blue, your health gurus, will see you in the next one. Bye!